are 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 we rolling? I pronounce that they are husband and wife. John, you may kiss your bride. You ready for this? Oh, yeah. <sighs> Tallene. <laughs> Love of my life. <laughs> it's of no surprise to me that we would end up standing before each other on a day as special as this one. It's a day just for us. <laughs> In the beginning, it took us a few test runs to get warmed up to each other, but somehow we managed to gravitate back towards each other. Stronger each time, eventually becoming inseparable. I can give you about 13 reasons why that happened. <clears throat> yeah, buckle up. <laughs> <laughs> Dear John, the day we become husband and wife has finally arrived. Today we solidify our love for each other before God, our family, and our friends. Our story began in a quirky way, which fully reflects who we are as a couple. The moment that stands out to me the most, and what I consider to be the official beginning of this journey together, was three years ago on the picnic bench at Luke's. The way you continually took the words right out of my mouth made me realize that there was an undeniable connection. A few months later, I told you that I loved you while wrapped in your arms and swimming in the ocean at Crystal Beach. <laughs> Loving you has made so much sense right from the beginning. Growing up, we hear the term soulmate I've always envisioned soulmate as more of a fairy tale idea to give people hope that there is someone out there for them. In my mind, it seemed that there's too many people in this world to know that one would ever cross that you're actual one person. That's where I was wrong. A soulmate isn't just one person, rather, it's someone who simply gets you, has a mutual respect, unconditional love, and complete understanding for one another equally. Colleen, you're undoubtedly my soulmate. Incredible! I was gonna oh, tell I'm... you not to cuss. Oh, gee, well, I'm just so excited. <laughs> Look at you. <laughs> I've been thinking about that all day, and I didn't realize that. Holy Jesus <laughs> Christ! Is it okay? It is the perfect dress. <laughs> just have one little gift for you. And I know this isn't gonna replace the one that you lost. <laughs> Man. If you flip it over. <laughs> this is something that you can hand down to your kids. That is absolutely wonderful. God, God bless America. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> I've never been prouder and more captivated by someone than I have with you. Your attitude, your character, your humor, your accomplishments, and more importantly, your ability, to, your ability to love me for who I am and what we have become together. The ins, the outs, the ups, the downs, kids, hopefully, coming and growing, and all the other wonderful things that fill the gaps in between. Colleen, I love you with all my heart, and I'll never give that up for the hopes that in the end, it will be the way it began, just ups. <laughs> I love you too.
Together we have traveled, loved our animals, strung Christmas lights, cooked incredible meals, watched lightning storms, survived two floods, and turned a house into a home. Together we have made countless memories that I will cherish for a lifetime. You came into my life the exact moment that I needed you. I was starting to think that true love might just not be in the cards for me, but thankfully you proved me wrong. My favorite thing that you say is how great this relationship is because we don't have to try. Being with each other is as easy as breathing. It just comes naturally. John, thank you for loving me in the greatest way I've ever known. You are the most loyal, helpful, and trustworthy person, not only to me, but to your friends and family. You've never made me feel judged or not good enough. You always find a way to lift me up and show me that I'm capable of more than I know. I couldn't have dreamed of a more perfect match for myself. And I'm so blessed that you have chosen me as the person you want to spend your life with. I promise to love you through the ups and downs in this roller coaster we call life. I will always be in your corner and I will always be your teammate in everything we undertake. I look forward to growing old together and seeing the world by your side as your wife. People ask me if I'm nervous, I'm going, no, she's with him. What I think makes me think that they are such a great match, a couple of things. Well, number one, I think she found an equal showman in him and a, <laughs> and a sense of humor to match hers. One of my biggest prayers for John was answered, that he'd find somebody who'd love and appreciate him, that this special person would be a great partner for him for the rest of his life. Thank you, Colleen, for being a blessing to John. And because of that, a blessing to all of us. Over time, Colleen and John solidified their connection through a mutual love of traveling, artistic creativity, and alter egos. The couple approach life with curiosity, optimism, and a sense of adventure. There is an electricity that these two generate to those around them. It has been a joy to witness their relationship develop and this chapter unfold. I know you two will laugh, support one another unconditionally, and grow confidently together through all of life's adventures. We're brothers by blood, but our bond is something few brothers have. Something in which I cherish more than you'll ever know. You're the nicest, most patient person I know. I've relied on you to have my back, support me, help guide me through life's most difficult and happiest moments. You truly are a remarkable brother, a person to everyone you meet. I know that you would take this new adventure in life with Colleen with as much passion and quirkiness as you do with everything. I love you, Bubba. Congratulations and thank you for the new sister. Now that John and Colleen have given themselves to each other by solemn vows, with the joining of hands and the giving and receiving of rings, I pronounce that they are husband and wife. John, you may kiss your bride. <laughs>